I think it's just that it, 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 even though it seems like something really unusual and strange and, and almost unbelievable is almost the way things really are that I think we experience. And, but yet, usually it's not reflected in, 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 a, a, in a, a cultural, you know, uh, a television show or a movie, things, especially at that time. But even now, you know, it's hard to get to that, that kind of strangeness beneath a surface of something seeming very normal. And, and expected, and and it, it, it just you know kind of goes in and rips it up, but in such a, an imaginative way. Also, I mean, on many levels, I mean, phys I mean, photographically, I mean, every way, you know, it's just amazing. I mean, I, I remember David, like, um, on, this was on the pilot, sort of. And they were running out of time, and he just sort of ripped out pages without looking at what pages they were. You know, I mean, it was like he was so confident that, in a way, everything was there, no matter what you did. It was there. He just, you know, had such a strong intuition and instinct, um, and he followed it. He really had the courage of his convictions and his beliefs. And I think, you know, having that, it makes it something original. And anything original is going to have a fan base. Uh, something so original is going to have a fan base, I think. Well, I mean, I think it completely changed it because before Twin Peaks, I mean, it's hard to even imagine. I talk, I mean, I've talked to people saying, "Well, before this, I mean, it just didn't exist." I mean, the the idea of having such an odd, dark underbelly and and a, a you know and showing it and yet showing both sides also sort of valuing both sides and not like just going to the dark side but having both sides be you know this you know uh, it's amazing um, you know that he did that and you know fantastic what do you think sparked the interest to create this footage for the public now you mean for, for oh i think it's just because of what you were saying the fan base i mean all the time i mean i'm really surprised how many people someone will be so excited that you know to meet somebody who worked on Twin Peaks I mean it's like it's sort of surprising I mean I understand it in a one way but I, I think that there's such a, a kind of hunger for it and I also don't think I think knowing more isn't gonna take away the mystery I think it's just gonna sort of add another layer of sort of enjoyment of the mystery and you know, that's my theory um, I don't know when it was. I don't, you know, I didn't really know about it till a few months ago, so I didn't. I don't know how long it was planned. I mean, you know, probably David always planned. <laughs>